Some of these sons of bitches could still be on our turf. I'll check the neighborhood. Make sure they're gone while you see Biff. Good hunting. Yeah, same. Okay, so when you're done with Vinny, come find me in Chinatown. Sure. Right. Let's go bust some heads. Let's go bust some heads, Paulie. Okay, so we need to go see Vinny. Hello, guys, and welcome back to part two of a Mafia. It is time we go bust some heads, but first, we need to go talk to Vincenzo and get ourselves sorted out. Hey, hey. here for some heaters, Tom. Oh, yeah. Nah, I'm already going and healed. <laughs> Paulie and me, we got to give a beating to some punks who've been on our turf. I don't want to pull this and piss in our own street. There's something to bust sets. That's all we need. Right. Oh, what you got? Over some guy's warehouse and, uh, okay. All right. Classic. Autographed by Babe Ruth himself, the guy said. I mean, it's horse shit, but they bust heads. True. Your punks won't have time for questions. True. No, they won't. Thanks, Vinny. Thanks, Vinny. All right. Meet Polly in Chinatown. All right. Can I take this car or no? I can. I'm going to take it. Nice. All right. Let's go, Tommy. Let's go, Tammy. Meet Polly. Hey, 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 hey. What you doing? Get out of the way. Okay. Um, ba, 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 ba. I feel like the radio is so low for some reason. Like, I can barely hear the radio. Which is, which you know, kind of defeats the purpose of having a radio on because you kind of want to hear it. Um, okay, and here is Chinatown. I love this car so much. It's so nice. It's such a nice shade of red as well, you know? It's not too light, it's not too dark. It's just right. So I'm happy. I'm happy with my car. Uh, where should I park up? Just here? Hey, Paulie. About time. Come on, I'm wet through. Why Biff moved into this dump, I'll never know. Give him a break. He's in love. Ah, uh, he got yellow fever that time we boosted the Shanghai skin flicks. Well, I like her anyways. Problem with you, Tom, you always soft with the dames. Well, yeah, no. Tom is Tom. Tommy's Tommy. Okay. Biff, you fat bastard. How you doing? Dogface, great to see you. Call her off, Biff. We got business. Upstairs, please. So, what's the beef? We need some information. Got some jokers causing trouble. They mess with Luigi's daughter. Yeah. Plenty of hoods around. You got any more? One of them's a weasel named Billy. Pals with a prissy chump and a bruiser with a bald head. Right, right, I know them. They're set up in the old service station in a block over. They hock some gear every now and then, in small time. <laughs> That's why I need to come to you, Biff. You're good with small time. Out the back, cross the street. You'll find them there. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Paulie. Uh, about that dough? Relax, just waiting for my guy to come through. It'll be next week. Just sit tight. Thanks, Biff. All right, let's go get him, Paulie. Another magazine. Three out of 20. What was that back there? Ah. You and Biff got something going on. Guy I know is bringing in a shipment of suits. 
classy ones, Mexican. Ooh. You getting suits from Mexico? <laughs> no, idiot. The suits are boosted from a lockup downtown. The tailor is from Mexico. Originally, anyways, he lives in Holbrook. Okay. I know about this. Yeah, yeah, I'll get his cut. You just keep this under your hat. All I right. Guess I heard nothing. Right, you right. You these punks when you see them? Yeah. Though, I guess if I don't, all we gotta do is find the other guys in Chinatown who look like we do. There it is. Okay. The service station. We are here. Big break tobacco. Here's how we do this. I walk in and start beating people. You do the same. No shooters. Okay, I long, like that. that one up. Nah, this plane gets used a lot. I think we gotta go in through the side. Alright. No shooting, only whacking. Baseball bats and all that. All of that fun stuff, right, Tommy? <laughs> Tell me What's the good, ass fellas? I've seen in my life. <laughs> hey, fellas. Oh, oh, Billy, it's the guy from the other night. There it is, we the other guy go. from the other night. <laughs> you messed with the wrong one, Sonny. Go get him! Guys, get get oh, I got it. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. All right, all right. Get him, Tommy, get him. Oh, 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 I forget. You really do have to be on... You've got you to be quick with the reflexes, you know? Is he down? He's out. Get him, Tommy. What? Wait, what? He's in the wall. He's literally in the wall. That is insane. Do you see the guy? Do you see the guy running in the wall? Look at him. He's stuck. Can I still get him though? I think I can. Am I getting him through the wall? I don't think so. Okay. Um. Come on, we gotta teach these punks <gasps> Oh Jesus, that's not fair. How was that fair? Jesus. All of a sudden he comes out of the wall. Just as I turn my back. I mean of course, right? Of course that happens. <laughs> okay. I'm coming poorly, I'm coming. Get your behind Oh Jesus. All right. Think I need telling. I go north, you go south. What? I go up, you go through there. Hey, I'm, I'm, okay. Shit. All right, Polly. I'm so low on health right now. It's not even funny. Right, go. Huh? <gasps> oh yeah! Have some fireworks, boys. Damn. Oh, that was bad. My way. I need some health real bad. Got him with the headshot. Any more in here? Oh, Holy yes. shit, baby. And you know it. And you know it. Okay. Clearing out the yard. I don't see anybody. So I think we cleared them out. I'll just pop that one just for fun, just in case. Okay, I'm gonna head down now. Get in there, Tommy. Let's go, Tommy. Okay. All right, got some ammo here. Another mag, another magazine. Where they at? You little, oh my God. Oh, guys. Behind me? What do you mean, behind me? Uh. Oh, bolt action rifle? Oh, baby. Hello, baby. Okay. Oh, yeah. 
Did we do it poorly? Are we good poorly? Okay, so I still have my pistol. That's fantastic. That's fantastic. I'm hoping for a first aid kit somewhere. Clear and a path to Billy Tom. We get to that punk for all the other punks. Take them down. All right, poorly. I hear you, poorly. Um, I really need some first aid, though. This is crazy. How does my health not regenerate? I mean, it does. Kind of. I think it is now, but I don't. I, I don't think it is. If it's like really low, then it will. Otherwise, it won't. It will just stop. <gasps> oh my god! Damn it! There's a first aid kit there. I need it. Ah! Get, get behind cover, Tommy. Oh, perfect, perfect. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, give me that. Give me that first aid. Ooh, yeah. Mmm. Uh, ba 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 ba. Should I get the shotgun? And do we things? Swap the shotgun for the bolt action rifle. What? Um. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I'll just stick with this. Why not? Why not? Uh oh. Okay, let me switch. Burn it. Ah. I hit. Ooh, E. There we go. Got the headshots. Just what I was looking for. Ah. Where you going, fella? Where you going? Come on, don't be shy. There you go. Lovely. Where are the rest of you? Huh? Where are the rest of you? What's this? Cigarette cards. Every time I run into Paulie, he's just like such a drama queen about it. He's like, Whoa! Uh! <laughs> you know, like... Relax, Polly. Relax, dude. You're fine. Stop being a baby about it. Stop whinging. Stop whining. You know? Okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. I want to play with my shotgun, but I need to get close range for it. <gasps> Jesus Christ! Got him. Got him, poorly. What was he coming? Oh, he's coming at me with a knife. Okay, that makes sense. That do make sense. All right, fellas. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. They're really trying to run, huh? The way Tommy Gary, kicks in down. the door is oh, come hilarious. Get out of here! We gotta get to a car, Tom! Scram! Ooh. Okay. Come on, we can't lose them! I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Don't let the punks escape. Okay. And it's raining, so you know it's gonna be quite slippery. It's gonna be a bit, it's gonna be a bit awkward, this is. Careful, Tom. The road's a river. That's what I'm Don't saying, Polly. Oh, this car does not go very fast. I should say that. It's very slow. You ever seen guys piss their pants this quick? If you look through the rain, you can see it dripping out the back of their car. <laughs> oh, I know. We caught them off guard for sure. They're definitely going to learn their lesson.
Oh, I love the fact that you can drift on here, you know? It's a lot of fun. I'm coming for you, boys. Out of the way! Get out of the way! <gasps> What the fuck is wrong with Jesus? I know. This car is so nice. All of the I've not found a car that I do not like yet, you know? And it's so hard to tell which cars are like the better cars and which are not. I mean if you look at the stats, then yeah, it's easy to tell, but going by the looks, they all look amazing to me. Okay. We're coming for you, lads. Punks, fellas, boys, you no good sons of guns. Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Like, move. Do you not see us like, what are you doing? I'm trying, Pauly. I'm trying. God, I hate it when games do that. They're like, let me just throw all the NPCs at you. Drive like I have. Exactly. Come on. This, the acceleration is so bad. The steering is so bad. The braking is bad. But we're still, we're still on them. Dumb there we go. <laughs> well, they're not walking away from that. Oh no, they're not. Beautiful. Whew. Go on a pop and pop. No, 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 wait. Please. Please, I don't want to fucking die, man. Christ, Tom. You can't feel sorry for these animals. A guy like this would plug you if you give him the chance. True. You pull the trigger without thinking. This I'm out. This one's finished, too. <sighs> Polly is a different type of breed, honestly. Oh, Christ, Tom. Snap out of it. Do you remember what those guys wanted to do to Sarah? Yeah. Just, uh... Hey. Get out of here before the bulls show up, huh? Wow, guys. Chapter complete. Better get used to it. Now, now it gets real. Now it's not just beating people up and, you know, collecting money. Now it's shooting young men in the head for really, really bad mistakes and stuff, you know. This was the kind of thing that I feel like Paulie was talking about when we had to drive him home because he was too drunk. Kind of, but not really. Like, it's the beginning of, you know, a different type of road in the, in the family. Does that make sense? So it's like... It's dark, you know, it's really dark. But he had a point, like, those guys, given the chance, they would shoot, they would shoot Tommy in the head, probably. Kill or be killed, that's the kind of mentality. Simple straight. <sighs> I can't afford this life no more. Just getting lucky. <laughs> I'll give you a chance to win your money back. You want in, boss? We have business to discuss, Paulie. We're in it now, boys. One of our associates at the coroner's office sent this over. Corpse's name is Giolotti. You recognize him? Sure. That's one of the punks we ran out of the neighborhood. Now he got the bullet in the back of his head? Yeah. We capped him. Well, the cops ought to thank us. We did him a favor. The guy was a rapist, boss. Yeah? Well, he was also a city councilor's son. You want to drive a politician into Morella's arms? There's no better way than killing off his family. Oh, Christ. It gets worse. You left another guy in the wreck? 
Yeah, but he was dead when we got there. You gonna tell me he was the president's nephew or something? Two in the head, Pauly. If you're gonna do a job, do it right. He made it? Yes. He spent the week in St. Mary's, but he pulled through. <sighs> Can he point a finger at either of you? I don't know. Maybe. Oh, okay. dear. Look, we're gonna kill two birds with one blast. Galati's funeral's today at St. Michael's. Sam, you're gonna attend. Oh. Sit in the back and try to spot the lucky bastard. How will I recognize him? He'll be the one who just crawled away from a car wreck. His arm is broken. Look for a sling. Sam's gonna need a little distraction if he's gonna clean up your mess. Oh he's my god. time to dip his wick? Is it brothel? A gentleman's club, just down the street from St. Michael's. The Don has invested a lot of money in it over the years. So, me and Sam. Regardless, the owner has suddenly decided to do business with Morello instead of us. You want me to go remind him of his obligations? Yes. Then blow the place up. What? What? Morello wants to take businesses away from us? He'll inherit craters. Look, Tom, we can send Paulie and Sam since all the ladies know them already. They never make it through the front door. But you can walk right in. Oh my god. Okay. What about the manager? Take care of him wherever you find him. If any of the horse see it, well, it'll be a warning. Once he's out of the way, head to his office on the top floor. Grab okay. any documents and money you find there and place the explosives. Okay. And Jensen will see that you have what you need. Okay. I think the blast will be big enough to give me cover. Yeah. But be smart. Only take a shot if you know you won't get made. Tommy, oh my one more thing. One of the girls is passing Morello information about our operations. Before you blow the place, you'll need to take care of her, too. <gasps> you want Tommy to kill a twist? Come on, Frank. It's just bad luck this falls to Tom. But we gotta protect the family. Damn Her it. name is Michelle. That's crazy. She's usually worked in one of the upper rooms. Her photo is in the folder. You boys clear on everything? Yeah. 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 Tom. I got it, boss. Then get it done. That's crazy. That's crazy. I have seen her. Hang on, give me a second. And you know who I am talking about. Go see Vin. I spoke to him. Counselor son is slain. Oh, just our luck, guys. William Billy Gilotti, son of LH City Council President Roberto Gilotti or Gilotti, was found dead by firearm-inflicted wounds this past Sunday. The body was discovered by police officers investigating reports of a wrecked automobile. There is presently no suspect or even a clear motive for this senseless murder, which bears all the hallmarks of a gangland execution. That's crazy. Nothing but trouble. My boy is being led I'm coming, Sam. You good? You gonna wait? Move it. We haven't got all day. All right, all right, all right, all right. I had a weird feeling though about Paulie leaving the guy that looked like he was dead. Like I had a weird feeling for a second that was like, maybe that's not a good idea. You know? Heard you hey, Vinny. For something that goes boom. Oh yeah. Oh, perfect. All ready and waiting for me. Give Thanks, those Vinny. Girls a squeeze from Uncle Vin, huh? <laughs> Not today, Vinny. Ah, <laughs> oh, Vinny, Vinny, Vinny. I think I'd rather have Vinny's job, if I'm honest. Can I get some ammo? I'm just gonna take some ammo. And what's in here? Ooh. Got a house you're going to has been headed downhill since 29. Though I guess the girls are still pretty. Shotgun. Yeah, let's get a shoddy. What's this? Pocket revolver. Service revolver. 
pick up a knife. A baseball bat. When you go after a guy, you gotta leave him dead. True. True. All right, thanks, Vinny. Let's go, Tammy. Get in. We have to talk. Yes, we do have to talk, Sam. Oh, this car is gorgeous. With the yellow Don't rims. Go place yet. Gotta hear me out on this. Okay. It's about the girl. Michelle? Right. You don't have to rub her out. Just make her disappear. You know her? Yeah. I've been with her a few times. She's a good egg, Tom. Just maybe not so bright. She doesn't deserve to get plugged just because she likes listening to me talk. You think she'll leave town? When she understands what'll happen otherwise. Yeah, she'll leave. Here's a hundred. Give it to her. And make sure she gets far away. Okay, sir. I'll see what I can do. That's all I'm asking. Let's go. Sam, you're an angel. But if I get the opportunity and if I if I'm able to make a choice, I will shoot her. Michelle. <laughs> she's the one from the racetrack, right? Tom, that was the last time we're ever gonna talk about her. Ever. I told you what I had to ask, and you listened. Gotta leave it there. Okay. Sorry, Sam. But like I said, if I get the choice. Keep your head when you get into the hotel. She's gotta go. Find your mark and don't act suspicious. Permanently. The manager <laughs> thinks he's untouchable. You can probably walk right up to him. Anything else I should know? Nah. Just don't take all day. Glad he died young, so there can't be much to say about him. When the bomb goes off, I'll do my thing. Got it. What mm. kind of world is it that when you screw up, you get sent to a cat house? Well, I have to clean up your mess at a funeral. You see the justice in that? I see a job I gotta do. Such a professional. Just try to finish a job this time, huh? All right, Sammy, all right. Jesus. First time I've been to a church in a while. Well, I'm gonna guess they're still singing the same songs. Last time I went, it was. Same songs I always heard as a kid. Yeah, you're not the religious type. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Game point, there were so many funerals, I just stopped going to most of them. They're all boring as hell. Yeah. That's a shame. Seeing as you're always dressed for the occasion. <laughs> Great gag, Tom. Write that one down. Thanks. <laughs> I'll do that. Now, weddings. Weddings are less boring. I'd go to one of them. You working on that? Uh, guess so. Good. Because I've given up waiting on Polly. Guy couldn't get a broad to stick to him if they went swimming through globe. <laughs> He'll find someone. Tom, if his own mother has given up hope, then you can give up hope too. Okay. Yeah, that'll be the day when Paulie gets a girl, huh? I mean, he's not a bad looking guy, but he's just, he's just sloppy, you know? He seems to be quite heartless. In comparison to Sam, Sam has more of a heart, you know? He's got more sense. Kind of. Kind of, in a way. And we are here, Sammy. Here's your step. I'll give the family your condolences. Good sure. luck. You too. Drive to the... Colleone Hotel. Okay. Now it's just me and you, Tammy. Luckily, it's not that far. So, gathering what I gathered from the meeting with the Dan. Um, he said that we can, we can basically just go in there and just 
like start shooting basically like there's no need to kind of be low-key about it if that makes sense damn Tommy looks good in this suit with the slicked hair and everything oh yeah Tommy hey you behave yourself in here okay okay Know where I can find the manager? I just watch the door, pal. All right. Hey, handsome. Hey. You here for a girl, drinks, or a mix of the two? A girl. And I got some business with your manager, too. A girl I can help you with. Come through. Find the girl you like, and you can both get better acquainted upstairs. Find There's Michelle. No rush, so get a drink. Relax. Come through when you're ready. Is there like a, a a book somewhere around here? Maybe it's upstairs. You get a room when you get a guy, not before. Ah, <sighs> fine. You know the rules, Dottie. And good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. What is she doing? Are you okay? I haven't started shooting yet. I don't know. I don't know why you're getting excited for. Just how I like them. I need to speak to Michelle. The only girls available are the girls you can see. Find one you like and don't make a fuss. Okay. Why don't you buy me a drink? Because you're not the dame I'm after. You know Michelle. I'm new here, baby. I don't know a thing. All right. Kill the manager in the lounge. I want to find we Michelle can just first. Talk if you don't want anything. What's a handsome man like you doing in a place like this? Looking for a girl named Michelle. She's busy upstairs, but I'm free. Okay, she's busy upstairs. Can I talk to this lady as well? Come just on, for that. I can tell you're nervous, but I can step you through what we gotta do. Hey, I'm looking for Michelle. You know her? Yeah, she's the popular one. Book yourself in with a guy at reception. You gotta get in line for Michelle. All right. Then I'll do that and not and not you. <laughs> uh. Okay. Hello, fine sir. Is Michelle in today? Let me check. I want to get Michelle first and then get the manager. Because it might be quite loud if I go in first for the manager, you know? And then I've got to go upstairs and find Michelle. She's in, but she's busy. If you're waiting for Michelle to come down, she ain't gonna. She's got fellas in with her all day long. All right. Well, I'm going upstairs You're looking then. for a good time? Come this way, sweetie. Nah, I'm looking for a friend. Michelle. Yeah. Sure you are. Come to my room and tell me all about her. <laughs> I just want to talk. You know, I get to hear that a lot. I bet you're not like all the other guys either, are you? Nah, not really. Do I have to follow her? I don't really want to. I want to find Michelle. But I can't just start kicking in doors, can I? Ah, where would she be? Where's Michelle? Uh. Upstairs in 208. That all you want? Thanks. That's all I want. I <sighs> wish they were all like you, sweetheart. 208. Thank you so much, darling. Upstairs in room 208. Okay, so I need to find another flight of stairs, and I have found them. 208. 208. Okay. Oh, you guys. Oh my god, I'm so nervous. Uh, 202. What's this? 208. Perfect. Oh my god. So she wasn't lying to me, which is good. Because we would have came back and we would have taught her a lesson. I'm joking. 
Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, there's a first aid kit. Okay, that's good to know. I like how it's on the map, you know. This is 209. Um, 208 is here then. Oh. You, Michelle? What's it to you? A fella named Sam is one of your regulars. Maybe there's a lot of guys named Sam. You know him. Works for Don Celieri. Maybe you got him talking about our business from time to time, and maybe Don Morello offered you some money to spill what you heard. No, Sam, trust me. I, I don't say nothing. He knows that. But Don's losing a lot of money because someone <laughs> can't keep their mouth shut. I was just bumping guns with some of Morello's girls. I didn't mean nothing by it. Tell him I'm sorry. Tell him I won't never open my mouth again. I know. <laughs> you gotta so do it, Tommy. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh. You're scared then. He's not gonna do it. Go I know he's not. Don't you ever forget how it feels to be this scared. To know you're just one twitch away from a hole in the ground. Because if you ever show your face in this town again, they're gonna find you with two in a head. Do you understand? <sighs> Tommy! You gotta listen to the dog. You gotta shoot her. Looking for you, Sam's got a big heart. Get dressed and make tracks. This place is gonna blow soon. Tommy! We're so gonna get done for that. Thank you. Just don't come back and we're square. Everybody's none the wiser. Can I go? Friendship between the Corleone Hotel and the Morello family will be long and fruitful. Oh my god, I'm so nervous, you guys. I'm really scared. Can I talk to him or do I just shoot him? Like, shoot him, shoot him? You must be the manager. Don Celieri sends his regards. Damn, Tommy! Hide! Oh my god. Reach the manager's office? Really? Oh yeah, I've got to, don't I? Ay, ay, ay. Oh my god. I don't know what the chairs are doing. Ah! That was a that was a perfect. Ah! That was a perfect shot that I had. Ah, oh, such bad recoil with this. Okay, what's this? Shotty. I, I'm 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 too far to use it, really. Ah! Right uh. Oh my god! Okay, I need to go around. Go, go, Tammy. First aid. Grab it, perfect, lovely. Ammo, perfect, lovely. All right, Tammy. All right, Tammy. Around here. Um. Get some cover. Hey, oh, get out of the way, lady. What are you doing here? I see you. What is she doing? You are in the worst position right now. Taking cover. <clears throat> uh. no. Okay. Nice. Go. 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 Where do I go? This way? <gasps> oh my lord. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> I know he was not talking to me. Ah. 
He's out! Hit him! Bad idea. You should have stayed away, Sonny. Get behind cover, Tommy! Oh my god. Why did I reload as I like came out of cover? Okay, moving up. See him! Together! Oh! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. No, 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 no. Damn it. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was so close. Oh my god, that was so close. He nearly got me. Oh my god. Okay. Ah. I'm out. Cover me. Get a better shot. Go. Ah. I survived, baby. Oh, yes, I did. Aha, ha, ha. I don't know what this is, but I'll take it. I need some first aid real quick. Um, First aid. First aid appears to be in this room over here. So, yes, perfect. Ah, I feel so better. Oh my god, the rooms are so nice. This hotel is gorgeous. For a dingy, you know, brothel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh my god. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> but it worked. Yeah, the way Tommy kicks in the door is is so I don't know I just really like it what the hell is with this gun though it's like a shotty I'm guessing right okay go 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 Nice, Tommy. Ah! Oh. oh, you don't know how I managed that, but I did. Okay. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I seem to have misplaced my revolver. Oh. Beautiful. <clears throat> Hang on. I don't have any Molotovs? Why not? I thought I did at some point. Get behind cover, Tommy. What are you doing? Ooh. Ah! There we go. There we go. Are we in here? Is this it? It is. Uh, okay. Dear Mr. Morello, the following patrons, patrons, patrons may be of interest. I have their details should you need them. Several city councillors and one congressman, senior officials in the federal tax office, Deputy Director of the Prison Service on Board of Appeals, Prohibition Bureau Chief at the LHPD. In addition, a number of Salieri's associates are sweet on our girls and fond of pillow talk. We will keep an ear out for your interests. Yours cordially, Howard Davis, Manager at the Collion Hotel. A letter to Mr. Morello. Mm -mm -mm. What's this? Money? Can I open the safe or no? I can't. That's a shame. Not a shame. What's this? Dear Mr. Coletti, I must have... Letter to Frank. Okay. 
Okay, I must apologize for missing our regular appointment last week. I had urgent family matters to attend to at short notice. It is with some great, with some regret that I write to confirm the termination of our in agreement. Mr. Salieri has been a wonderful business partner over the years. I am most grateful for his support and your wise counsel. Please find. With this missive, with this missive, a return of Mr. Salieri's investment, along with a hundred dollars as a gesture of goodwill. Our doors are always open. We remember our friends here at the Colleon. Yours cordially, Howard Davis, manager. A uh, letter to Frank. Mm hmm. Oh yes. Anything else before I blow this place? to ashes I don't think there is it's such a, it's just so nice though the way everything looks is just gorgeous there's nothing behind the desk nothing at all nothing in the drawers nope okay time to blow up the place then Uh oh. Damn it. Ooh, Tammy. Out the window, I think. Jesus. Mm hmm. It's gotta be done. A little bit of a. Ooh. That was a bit lucky. That wasn't it, it wasn't as big as I was expecting, to be honest. Over here. Oh my god. Oh my god, just run, Tommy, just run. Oh, there's a ladder. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm not even looking. I'm just running at this point. Can I jump over the wall? Nope. There's a magazine around here, what? Okay, I think it's on the other side. Ah, uh, ba 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 ba. Where is it? I don't know. Over here? Yes it is. Lovely. Okay. I use the ladder? Oh. Oh, very clever. Very clever, Tammy. Damn. It's a slick trick. Escape through the church. Oh, how very fitting. Oh my no god. Contact with the fellas on the roof. Feels like we lost him. Okay. First aid. Oh, I go down? I guess I do. He was a sinner, yes. But he was also a loving son. A protective brother and a loyal friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now I believe one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. I, uh, I just wanted to pay my respects. Mm hmm. Billy, I never said this, but. I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good. What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy. What the hell is wrong with you, Tommy? That was Sam's job. Please, Jesus. 
Oh my god, he's just, I mean, it's just like... It's just so bad. Uh, now you're done! What the hell? Ah, I'm dead. No, I'm not. I nearly was, though. What happens to my guns? I'm out! Cover me! Oh, guys, this is driving me nuts! I have no ammo. I have no ammo. Uh, he looks like all hell. Oh. Okay. Jesus. Tommy just stays making a bad decision after bad decision after bad decision. And you... <laughs> uh, I don't know why I did that. That was, that was really stupid. Okay, Johnny is upstairs, is he? I guess he is, right? Down there! Shoot him before he comes up the stairs! Bring it! Gotcha. Ah! Damn it, you guys. It's not hard to aim. I mean, it is hard to aim on here. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Oh! Oh my god. Okay. You interrupt his funeral. You think you're better than us? You could have stopped all this days ago. Nice, Tommy. First day, it's beautiful. Beautiful this game. Is the way this city works. Okay. Get there, up on the balcony. Yeah. Found him. There we go. Finally. Oh, we got a Tommy gun for Tommy. Um, ba 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 ba. Now you're done. Oh, I'm coming for you, you Johnny. I'm, this? Oh, I'm here. He's on me. <laughs> there we go. Jesus. A house of God! I'm sorry, but it's gonna be done. <gasps> it's just me and you now, Johnny. Beautiful! Yes, Tommy! What have you done? Murder in the house of God! These men were criminals, Father. Thieves, <gasps> rapists, killers. Oh. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. I'm way too now, into this. Which one of these men <laughs> might have sought redemption by working with the poor? Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, Father. What? You bastard. If you have any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No Where's more bloodshed, Sam when you please. Need him? I'm sorry, Father. Consider this an act of divine retribution. There you go. Nice of you to show up. Thank you very much. That make us even? Sure. For now. For your trouble, Father. I don't want your blood money. You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. True. That should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes and keep you quiet. <sighs> when the cops come, you tell them the gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town, right? I won't lie. 
But I won't say anything at all. Good. Be a shame if we had to come back here. Thank you, Father. As soon as I walked into church, the crew recognized me. Followed me straight back out. We're all uh... in the same place as all these guys. We gotta go. Damn you, Johnny. Making us run around and... Run around and stuff. Oh, I need to get the magazine. Before I leave, I need that magazine. You're damn right I do. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, my God, 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 oh, my God. Oh, my God. Go grab some first aid. Where? From where? We got him! From here. Around the church, boys. Don't let him out. Move up! Get the hell out! Are you Don't kidding? Don't pull that trap! Ah. Wheels down and down! We can run find another. <sighs> yeah, I know that, oh. Sam. Jesus. Okay. One more. All right. This? No. Get in the car. Let's go, Sam. Come on, let's go, 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 go. There's no end. Suspect and accomplice escaping in a hearse. I repeat, <laughs> a hearse. Taking a right. Don't bring the cops with you. Yeah, I think that's. A, yeah, I agree. I think that's a good idea. Well, today didn't turn out like I expected. Just I know. Drive, or we'll end up in the back. True. Ah. Uh. Okay. Nice. Whatever you did at the cat house got the cops plenty pissed. Yeah, it was messy, but I got everything done. Everything? Yeah. Everything. Yeah, everything. Okay. Oh my god. No. They must have called out every cop in the city. We've got three stars, Sam. Let's not get another. Just keep it at three, you know what I'm saying? Come on, Tommy, lose him. I'm, I'm trying, trying to, I'm trying to. What's with you today, Tom? Say Christ. Gonna be Beautiful. trying to forget anyway. You're telling me. Let's get back to the bar. We gotta lie low. The way this all went down, we gotta lie low for weeks. Ah, the priest will keep his trap shut. Don't worry. Morello got a bloody nose. And you and Polly are in the clear for whacking Galati's son. Boss will be pleased. Hmm. I don't think the boss is going to be happy when he finds out that we let Michelle go. Because obviously he's going to find out. Because obviously, you know. Somehow, some way, he's going to find out. And, and the real issue is, the reason why she was talking was because she was getting information from Sam because Sam was just being too loosey-goosey with his mouth, you know, and pillow-talking her and letting the info out. So, really, we did Sam a favor, a massive favor, by letting her go. Like I said, if I had the option, I'm sorry, you made a mistake, and it cost you your life. <laughs> because, obviously, you know, you gotta, you've got to follow orders when you're in the Mafia. Okay, here we are. Thanks again, Sam, for helping me out back there. I thought my time was up. It's not anything you wouldn't do for me. I know, mm -hmm. but when you come that close to biting it, Christ, it's something. Don't need to tell me about that. Just don't think about it. Best lesson I could ever teach you. Don't think about anything. All right. Okay. Chapter complete. The Saint and the Sinner. Intermezzo. 1938. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. 
and I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know, I could take you in right now, put your buying bars, and tell you all in gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Morello. Hey, fellas, sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. <laughs> All right, we've come this far together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. It wasn't even in the papers. Low for seven, eight months. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. We recovered mm. some account books from Morello's offices. 33 was a pretty good year for him. Bastard knew we were bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet mm. at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. Mm. You need not catch on? Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do. Except mm. drink, have a few laughs. Every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. So it was a good year. Until Frank. A Coletti, a Don's consigliere. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with that, though. Then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm trying to teach you the ropes so you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. A little mutt when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from the Sicily, I had this <coughs> beautiful, skinny Cherneco de Letna. Like de a little greyhound. Mm. Fastest dog you've ever seen. Mm. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together, betting on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. Mm. We were only out of pocket knife, but I never saw the Don so angry. Wow. She got old on you? No. Pregnant. She oh. went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. Oh, okay. I like that dog, Tommy. Oh. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat. And everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. And once you get fucked, you're no good to us. Wow, Frank. Do you understand? I think so. I think I do, yeah. yeah. You made your point. You made your point. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, police at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy, you could run this town someday. Wow. Well, I uh -huh. appreciate that, Frank. So, uh, what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. I broke his nose. Really? You can let me off here. Give Sarah my best, Tommy. Frank, Frank, Frank. 
I think I'm starting to warm up to him, you know? He's a, he's a bit complex. He's hard to read, you know? But I like that. I think. A trip to the country. I wasn't sure about him in the beginning. Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Ah, Tommy. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back. Eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. Meet Frank out back. Okay. Oh, what's this? Read a note. Note from Frank. Luigi, Sarah loaned these books to March. To March. Please return them with our thanks, Frank. No, it's a good to see a smile back on Sarah's face. It's a good to see a smile on back on Sarah's face. <laughs> uh, that's never going to get old, the accent. Where is he? Thanks for waiting, Tom. The Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again. Sure. So what's the job? I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight. The good stuff? Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at the farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city, but I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie to meet Polly at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case earmarked for the Don. Okay. Drive to Salieri's warehouse. Hey, Ralphie. Working late, Ralphie. I says his sleep when Frank sleeps. Man, he's been working us hard. Mm. Morello's taking bites out of business everywhere else, Ralph. Booze racket's where we shine. We gotta stay ahead someplace. Ah, well. I just f f f fixed the cars at the time. I changed the p p plates again. You can't be too careful. I'm good. See you in the morning. Okay. Oh, bless him. Thanks, Ralphie. Okay, let's do this, Tom. This game is just so gorgeous, you know? Oh, what's going on here? Oh, little road accident. That's fun. Going over the bridge. I see, I see the red line on the map. But I don't understand what the blue line is. You see to the left on the map there, there's like a blue line. I don't know what, what that's for. Maybe that's the route that the police take or something. I don't know. That was close. But yeah, I'm still really surprised. I really am so surprised that the game is literally nothing but main missions, you know? I really wasn't expecting it. I thought because the city is so big that obviously there would have to be a ton of side missions and obviously there would be a clothing store and obviously there would be like just a general store where you could just go in and buy stuff and obviously we would have an apartment which we could access like anytime we wanted to and obviously there was just you know all of that kind of stuff but there isn't and 
I really love that. I love how it's a big city, a big town, you know. But just nothing but the main story and nothing else. I love it. Come on, Tom! Hey, hey! Watch it, pal! Just dry it out! Sorry. All right. All right, Paulie. You know this place? Oh, uh, yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. Boys will load up the trucks, and we'll come straight back. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it sooner or later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Oh my Polly. god, stop, oh, Polly. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. You're going home to a couch. <laughs> now, I wonder what kind of stories she could tell about her old man, though. I believe he was a stone-cold killer back in the day. No, really? Know. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. Yeah. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Yeah. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Mm. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. Damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something smells off. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. I don't like this, Paulie. He ain't coming. I don't like this. Okay. Let's go find them. That bastard is just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here, just in case Frank was right. Oh, guys, I'm I don't go like grab this. Them boys, get them sorted out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. Okay. I don't like this. I don't like this. Find Sam, search for clues. This place for sale at public auction on the 1st of August, 1933. I don't like this. I really don't. Someone's been waiting here tonight. One quarter out of work. Government report shows no end to slowdown. Measures to date have failed to halt economic slide. Unemployment stands at 25%. Farm foreclosures are at a two-year high as smallholders battle the combined threat of financial hardship and the dust storms choking the high plains. In response, the president proposes new legalization to stabilize the banking system. All right. All right. Yeah, I feel like we're about okay, to get jumped here. Check them and pretend to find them. There's a whole lot of places that we could hide for cover, you know, so I'm expecting us to get jumped at some point. Don't feel right. Yeah, tell me you're telling me. And I'm telling you the same thing. Read a note. Missing farmer found dead. Lost heaven. 
uh, June 17th, Harry Smith, missing for two months, was confirmed dead today by the Lost Heaven County Coroner Office. A fruitless search led by the farmer's father and neighbours ended several weeks ago. The grisly discovery of the body was made by local children looking for edible mushrooms and berries in Woodland Local to Cops Farm. The death is not being treated as suspicious due to how Mr. Smith's body was found, hanging by the neck. He is survived by his elderly father. What <gasps> kind of guy a dog. shoots a dog? Oh, duh. a maniac? Some kind of psychopath? There's a lot of lights that are on, but, you know... That seems to be it. Just a dead Where the dog. Hell are you hiding? Investigate the truck. I'm not done looking around yet. Can I go through the bush? I can't. Yeah, I'm gonna have to just go to the truck. Oh, I don't like this, Tommy. I really don't like this. <gasps> First aid kit. Oh, you know it's about to go down. Oh my god. Hey buddy. Oh I think he's dead. Jesus. Drop he's dead. your weapon. You first. We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay then. Get over here! I got him pinned down! Uh, kill the ambushes. Yes, I did. Take this guy out. Come you on, show your face, twice. handsome. There you go. Beautiful. Investigate the ambush. Um, so there's a clue over here. Read a note. Canadian Telegram. Canuck cousins meet at usual place. Uncle is happy that gift is on is on way. This was a setup. <gasps> it was a setup by the Canadians? No. Oh guys. Nothing about this feels right. Oh. Wow! Well, it's me, Tom! Polly! What took you so long? Looking for Sammy? Did you find him? Nah, not no. yet. Just him. Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. Christ. What? The cops, Tommy. Oh, shh. Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. Oh. It must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. This is bad, Paulie. This is bad. Forget about it, Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. Oh dear. Border Patrol. Ooh. This is a this was a good setup, Morello. These guys are the real deal. They gotta be cops from the Border Patrol. They've come heavy, alright. Make lost heaven PD look like pussy cats. 
Oh yeah. What's in here? There's something in here that I want to grab. Read a note. Cops Farm, 9 o'clock, north on country, on County Road, two miles right at gas station, follow sign to dam one mile, then left at bridge. Damn, they did a little map and everything. Those cheeky buggers. As if. We fully got caught with our pants down. All right, Polly. Okay. Keep your eyes Search open. The farm. We find Sam. We get the hell out. Anyone mm. else? We slip from the boat. Get it? Get it. I get it. Come on, fellas. Ah! <gasps> There's a whole lot of blood here. Oh wow. <gasps> All shot in the back of the head. Must have been lined up. Oh my god. Poor bastards. Oh my god. Read a note. Canadian passport, personal description. Joseph, profession, bottler. Place of birth. Winnipeg, Canada, date of birth, 6th of October, colour of eyes grey, colour of hair red. That's an interesting combination, isn't it? Um, Molotovs, definitely. Hand them over. Yeah. I'm going to search this building over here. Suppressed cough. Sack. Ah! Did he die? He did. Oh my god, you hear that? It's all going down outside. Hang on, I kind of want to search the. Um, I don't think it matters really. I think Sam is over there, isn't he? But if there's like stuff to read and things like that, then I kind of want to. There's nothing. There. No, there's nothing. Yeah, it was completely pointless. Really, just very pointless. Public sale. Okay. Come on, fellas. Let's do what we came here to do. Which is find Sam. And then get the hell out of here. Ooh, ammunition. Beautiful. What's this? Oh, a note. Oh. Following the seizure of Cops Farm and the foreclosure of the business of J. Smith and Son by the Grand Imperial Bank, Lost Heaven assets will be sold at public auction. You ready, Paulie? Right <gasps> Come on, fellas! Push through! Oh. Hurt, huh? Hang on, fellas. Ah! Okay. Where are you, boys? Okay. Let me just go get the first aid. And then I'll come back out. 
Beautiful, Tommy. Beautiful. I'm gonna move up. There's one round here, right? Beautiful. Nice one, Tommy. Thank Christ. We gotta get to him. I'm a lot better with aiming now, which I'm happy about. You boys stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Except us. Sam? Sammy! Hey, Polly. Mm. Sammy, for oh, Jesus, what have they done to you? Oh, I don't think he's gonna make it. That looks bad. Grace has a lot of blood. Can you walk? No, I don't think so. Okay, 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 just hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you gonna make it, Sam? <laughs> Tommy, mm. stay here with him. I'll be back, I'll be back in a flash. Okay. Oh, Sammy. Hey. Hey, it'll be okay, Sam. We survived worse. Sure. Sure we are. <gasps> oh, what, what useless drivel they are. What kind of what kind of clowns? From? What kind of clowns are we hiring nowadays? Gotcha now. Ah! Come on, get him! Thank Christ, dead. Oh my God, I know. I'm about to get clipped. Is there a first aid up here? Nice, Tommy. I was waiting to do that. Uh oh. Okay. This one's on me. Count me out, Tom. I'm hurting over here. Hang on. Jesus, this hurts. I know it does. Okay. Check on Sam. Jesus Christ! Ugh. Where's the goddamn truck? Let me get, I need this Tommy gun. Crap, we got cops! <gasps> We do? Oh, yes, we do. Over here. Over here. Polly, where are you? Oh my god. What do you think you're climbing up to, huh? You better get you better get back down, Sonny. Okay, perfect. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what a just what a what a what a what nightmare, guys. Yeah. What a nightmare. What a fucking massacre. I know. How's Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. What are you thinking, Tommy? 
What, you, what are you thinking? <laughs> Maybe he's just trying to keep a lookout. Okay. 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 We're gonna get y'all patched up. Okay. You're lying. We got more company. That's an armored car. All right. Get in. That's a different kind of beast. That is. Is that a SWAT right team or something? It's some ammo and a Thompson back there somewhere. And a Thompson. Okay. When they pull in behind you, blast them down. Just don't let them get past us. I'll try. Oh, Lord Jesus. That thing back there is huge! Where the hell did they find that truck? Reload. You think we're okay now? Now you! These guys keep on coming! You like that, you okay. bastards! Ah! Oh. You got him! Keep going, Tommy! Reload, Tommy, reload. We're in trouble, Tom! I know! My pedal is to the metal! <sighs> Did we lose them? Not really. Two squad cars on us! Polly! Come on! Get us out of here! Okay, one down! Nice. That's better. More bad news coming in from the side. Ah, crap! Get too close, Tom. Ah, you got him. Keep going, Tommy. Okay, I'm trying, fully. You like that, you bastards? Oh. Okay. Another. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Woo. Are we stuck? Sam, you okay? We're in trouble, Tom. Oh, Tommy. Ah. How are they just taking bullets Ollie, to the whole body? To now. With their little pieces of fabric as uniform. Do you see that? I know. Oh, hold on, Sam. Ah. Are we okay? Oh my God, that was a bit of blood. Oh, we are there too, Tom. Paulie's. Paulie is. Paulie is something else. Uh oh. Oh, we blew up. The truck was destroyed. Load. Last checkpoint. Okay.
damn. Oh. Oh my goodness. Okay. I think we have like half of the truck health left, you know? Like the bar is half way empty. A little bit more. I've really, it's, it's so hard to be accurate because they're swerving around and we're swerving around and obviously, you know, that doesn't make it easy for me. My God. So I've just got to be as accurate as I possibly can be when I do have the chance. I'm giving it everything I can. Have I done it? I think I did. Ooh. What, Sam? Ooh. Okay, Sam. <laughs> Good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm missing. There we go. Holy, we gotta lose him! <laughs> That's what you get, cops. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay, we're here, Tom. You get Sam out. I'm gonna go wake up the doc. <laughs> that was tough. Sam. That was tough. We made it. But we did we're it. The doctor's house. <laughs> Three, I owe you. <laughs> yeah, uh -oh. I thought he was gonna die then. I was like, we can't we can't have gone through all of that for you to just die now, Sam. What the hell are you doing here so late? Uh, uh, we need to help. <laughs> Evening, Doc. Sorry to wake you, but um, we had a little accident. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, uh, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. <laughs> the Doc's already got his hands full. No sense of both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, All right. I'm gonna be fine. Okay, Sam. You better. You'd okay. better. Hey. You did good tonight. Cheeky. Hey, you did good tonight. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thanks. That's just what we needed, you know. Nice little cute compliment. After all of that. No, oh, Tommy. Drive to Sarah's apartment. Okay. Oh, I keep. You see? You see? When I get to a car, I press Y instead of X. <laughs> Because I'm so used to it. Here we are. At Sarah's apartment. And she's peacefully reading a book, having a glass of red wine. 
You're late. Dinner's cold. Like Tommy said. Okay. Oh my god, that's so sweet. Like Tommy said, Sarah knows not to ask too many questions, you know? So... And that was one of a proposal. Chap to complete a trip to the country. A murder? A murder? Hey, bud. I came as soon as I got your message. Sit down, Tom. We have a mole, Tom. No. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. I started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books to see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? The books are gone, Tom. <gasps> Frank. No. <sighs> More than no. 50 years I've known him. <sighs> Everything I have, I got with Frank. <gasps> and every buck we've earned, every dime we've paid out, it's all logged in those books. Frank hands those over to the feds, we're finished. Frank respects <gasps> one person in this whole town, and that's you. This has got to be some kind of misunderstanding. I've been calling him all day. I went by his place. He's gone. His wife and kid are gone. <gasps> but why? I don't know. I'm sure he has his reasons. Maybe he's still smarting over the dog. But when you tried to drown. Yeah. <sighs> Same one I shot after he wouldn't let me sink her. <gasps> I was a stupid kid, Tommy. But grudge or no grudge, we gotta get those books back. Shake down all our stories. See who knows what. Oh. When you catch up to Frank, you get those books. And if he doesn't have them on him, you make him tell you where to find them. Mm hmm After that, mm -hmm. you do what we gotta do. Yeah. Oh. Salieri. Oh. Vincenzo's waiting for you with a clean car. Oh my god. Frank! I just know it. You know, what did I just, what did I say, guys? I wasn't sure about Frank Last in the beginning. Frank, he kind of looks, he no kind of, you know what, he feels like the type that, Dark business. that yes. would jump ship once the sink, once the, once the ship started sinking, you know? He would jump ship when the he Fed knew. Those books, our whole operation's at risk. 
when he knew that that the side he was on wasn't going to win. The feds get those books. Oh, Frankie. Maybe I guess it is coming down to the whole dog situation that Salieri did shoot the dog, did shoot her after she she uh after Frank broke his nose and he wasn't he he wouldn't let him drown her and blah blah blah. Maybe that's maybe that's the maybe that's what it came down to in his head. He was like, Well, he did shoot my dog, you know? Well, I feel like now is a good time to pause it here. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. And we will come back in the next part and hopefully find out about what happens with Sam. But also, also, we're going to have to deal with Frank as well. So thank you guys so much for watching this part of Mafia. Hopefully you guys are enjoying it. If you are, then you know what to do. But otherwise, I will see you guys in my next video.